Hey everyone, in the Space Marine 2 How to Get Requisition video, I want to talk about this system and what you need to do to earn that. So you can get requisition in two of the game modes. So if we go to the interact option here, operations or eternal war will earn you requisition. So if we have a little look at operations first, because this one's nice and clear, basically if you complete the operation, you will earn yourself a 35 requisition if you're on the default mode. Now, one of the things you can do to up that is if you increase the difficulty, but when you first jump into here, your difficulty, you can't really change until you jump in and kind of jump out again. So I'll just show you that. So we'll switch the game mode to this. We'll just say tactical, whatever. And uh, when we're now in here, I'll leave that squad like so, except, and now I'll be able to go in here and just change the difficulty because this is a way that you can earn more requisition. Now, top left, you see it says threat minimal. Press square for that. And if we have a little look at one of these bigger choices here, we will earn more requisition and also more XP. Now, the one thing to bear in mind is that it recommends a level for your Space Marine. So the harder you set this to, the more requisition you could potentially earn, but you need to complete the operation. If you fail to complete the operation, I don't think you earn any requisition whatsoever. So it was 35 on threat minimal. If I changed it to this one, I'll get a warning saying my current class is lower than the recommended. Do you want to change the difficulty anyway? I'm going to say yep. And if we now have a little look at these, you can see that I would earn 55 requisition for each of these levels now compared to the 35 to begin with. So that's pretty cool. You've got the same sort of options in Eternal War, but I think this varies depending on your performance in the game mode. So there's no clear uh, amount that I think that you earn from each game. I think it's just based on performance and how you go through it. Um, so if you want a clear cut way, it's that one. If you want a kind of more random way, it's the turn of war. And what's the difference between the two? So this one, you're playing a set mission or objective to complete or indeed an operation. That would make more sense, wouldn't it? Um, but, and that takes about half an hour. Uh, Eternal War, uh, it's six versus six set up where you've got different options. You've got seize ground, yeah, funny enough, you see some ground capture and control where you have to control an area or annihilation where it's just all out uh, Barnian or war. And um, these uh, typically about 20 minutes, but it could end sooner depending on the score, uh, whether the other team smashes the other team or not. Uh, and you should earn requisition that way. Uh, one other thing I just want to point out, if you're not sure what on earth requisition does, if we just go to the armoring hall, uh, you can use it to buy certain bits and bobs in here. So I'll just show you this and I'll show you what my current requisition is. I need to play more because I've spent too much of it. Uh, so if we have a look in here, uh, you've got some options. Actually, I just want to point out another place you can earn requisition, which is trials. So if you complete these trials, so this one, if I did an all spec scan and complete in 40 seconds or whatever, you can see I'd get a reward of 10 requisition here. So requisition is that little number there up the top right. Uh, and you see I've got 55 that I could spend on other things here. So in the mode that I've got, I could go to edit armor. Uh, and then I could spend this on the Astartes chapters. Or Astartes, I don't ever know how to say it. But people go, no, it's this way. And thank you very much if you correct me. But I can't remember what it is anyway. But anyway, we can have a little look in heraldry. And these things, yeah, you know, the different chapters, you can opt to purchase these. So if I wanted the Dark Angels, I have to buy them in succession. So I'd buy 30 here, then this one would unlock and I could buy that, etc., etc. I think I've got one that I've partway unlocked, which is this one down here. The Ultramarines, Praetors of Orpheus. The next one would be the Lieutenant Armor part, um, which would get me this rather cool space helmet, but I need to get 90 uh, requisition to earn that one so that would be my next option there which is why I don't want to spend my requisition but if I had enough that would show as a clear option like we saw with the emblem a minute ago on one of these so if I wanted this one I do have enough for that which is why it's highlighted in white rather than red there you go my friends that's how to get requisition I hope that was useful to you if it was give us a thumbs up please that's much appreciated any comments welcome if you need more help with Space Marine 2 have a little look at the tutorial playlist that I'll put at the end of this video and if there's anything missing do let me know in the comments and if you like what I do hit that subscribe will you thank you